I'm here today with Hugo Santos, the former CTO of Blast. You just got back from uh, the start of Sauna warm-up tour. So I just came back from Warsaw. Uh, before that we were in Tampere and before that we had the warm-up in Helsinki and the first one was in Riga. Oh wow, you've been really traveling a lot. Yeah, the guys are just now traveling also to Moscow and uh, St. Petersburg and then we'll have one more warm-up in Budapest. So we try to reach out, or the, the mission of the program is to try to reach out as much as possible from the Nordic and uh, Eastern European uh, countries. Um, what actually was pretty surprising was the quality of the startups was mostly the same across the different countries and, uh, and the different cities. Uh, you did see some slight differences, uh, for instance between Helsinki and Tempere. Uh, in Tampere, we saw a lot more mature uh, startups, perhaps because many of those guys were coming out of Nokia or they had already some background uh, uh, building products. And in Poland, we saw actually a much younger crowd, uh, 21, 22 year olds. I was really surprised and positively surprised by seeing people uh, trying to be an entrepreneur already at that age, uh, which is not so common in Europe as it is, for instance, in the US. Yeah. Uh, but the general quality was more or less the same. Uh, you see even variations of the same ideas, uh, not exactly the same ideas, but variations of the same ideas uh, being pitched. So we can see that actually the problem space between the different countries is not that different. Uh, maybe we are much closer than people actually think. So the spring felt like it was all about healthcare startups, and uh, maybe social media analytics. Mm -hmm. Have you seen some other trends coming up? Uh, see a lot of um, lifestyle slash uh, health based startups popping up uh, more and more. People trying to um, uh, connect people together or improve their lives in a sense. Uh, I, I would say that was a rising trend for, for these last few warm ups. I think slush will be really big. Uh, the guys believe that they will run the biggest uh, uh, Nordic event uh, really with startups and, and from everything I see, the speakers coming on board and the buzz that is being generated around it, I really think they'll do it. And it's really exciting the idea that they'll merge in a lot of the competition also into slush and use it as an opportunity to also provide coaching, uh, coaching to, to startups. Uh, I think that having that event where you bring all these key players uh, of the scene together, it's, there's only positive things to take out of it. And I really believe it's going to be big.